Nah, okay, this is depressing, but I'm gonna keep it real, okay? I will give you guys the respect of my honesty. I'm at a point in my life, because I played private servers for a long time, over and over and over and over and over again. TBC server, vanilla server, TBC server, vanilla server. I played a lot of different private servers. I'm at a point in my life as a gamer and as an adult where I am unsatisfied with the only way that I can have fun playing games being replaying 15-year-old games. I don't want that to be my destiny as a gamer. Just to always be on a two-year cycle or an 18-month cycle hoping and praying, please, I want a new fresh, I want to do it again. I'm past that. Me, I got everything I wanted out of Classic. I'm satisfied. I'm, I, I can put that on the shelf, okay? What I want is new fun games. I want new experiences. I want to do new fun stuff. Not keep doing the same shit over and over and over again. Classic is good. I like classic. I like vanilla. I know that because I've played so much of it, right? But I want to I want to find new fun stuff to do. I have unplugged my fucking copium tank. Okay? I feel like I unplugged from the Matrix. I've, I that's actually the best fucking analogy. Okay, I feel like you know what I mean. I feel like Neo. I took the fucking red pill. You know, you can keep living in the classic world, and it's sunshine and rainbows, right? Or you can like take your head out of the sand and take the fucking red pill. And there's like other experiences and maybe the world isn't so pretty, but there's other shit to do. And like, that's where I am. That's where I am, okay? I'm ready for new shit. No, I mean, dude, I did everything I wanted in Classic. And uh, I'm just, I've played vanilla so many times. I've played on tons of vanilla private servers. I, w I want new games. Also, I'm gonna be honest. Like, I think Blizzard shit the bed on Classic. I think Blizzard shit the bed big time, even bigger on TBC. Blizzard doesn't, bl like, Blizzard has maintained this game so fucking poorly. I'm, I'm just, I'm completely, I feel totally apathetic. And I'm, I'm still playing TBC because I like to raid and I like my guild and I like my boys, but, uh, you know, it is what it is. It is what it is. Elaborate on Blizzard maintaining the game a bit. Uh, yeah, they don't ban bots. Or if they do, they don't ban enough of them. They don't ban gold buyers and gold sellers. Or if they do, they don't ban enough of them. And they're obviously doing, like, blatant cash grab things with TBC, a la 58 boost. The 58 boost has caused so much damage for TBC. It's, like, n name, name a problem in TBC, and it goes back to the 58 boost in some way. I'm just, I'm just, like, I I'm, I'm just, like I said, I'm completely apathetic. I'm just, like, whatever, I just don't give a fuck. I'm fucking unplugged, bro. I'm unplugged. Is T5 gonna change it for me? Uh, No. I mean, right now, I feel like there's not a lot to do in TBC. I play six hours a week. I do my raids. Outside of that, I don't give a fuck. So when T5 comes out, I have 12 hours of shit to do instead of six hours of shit to do. Does it really fix the, the overarching problem? Not really. This guy says, quit WoW if you don't like it. Legit, just quit if you don't want to play. WoW players, every time we have these conversations, there's guys like Logran in the chat that are like, oh yeah, if you're unhappy with something, just quit, bro. You know that WoW has been losing subs for like 10 players, or t 10 years, right? People are quitting. That's the problem. Blizzard is ruined retail, and they're ruining Classic and TBC again. People are quitting. You act, you act like, you know, it's like put your money where your mouth is. People are doing that. I want you to know, I already quit WoW once at, when Kata came out, and I played private service for 8 years. And then Classic came out, and I'm like, okay, I'm gonna dip into this because Blizzard promised that... You know, it's, uh, it's not going to be like retail. And then they're doing the same shit they did in retail. Like I just said, I like raiding. I like my guild. I log in to do my raids. That's it. I like to raid in TBC. And I like my guild. I like playing with them. So I log in to do that. Outside of that, I'm pretty hands off. But is it worth the sub then if it's only thing? So I'll tell you, all through Classic, I maintained three accounts. I had a Horde account I used. And I had a second account uh, that I have my Paladin on. And I have my uh, main account here. I had three subs through Classic. I unsubbed two of those accounts. I only have my one account subbed right now. So I have my one sub and I, and I raid on this account. But yeah, for, for me, Blizzard lost two subs. I'm not, paying, I'm not paying for the other two accounts anymore. Because I just, I just don't use them. I just don't care. Don't care to use them. Yeah. But uh, no, for me, yeah, I'm going to keep subbing on this account because I like to raid. It's very simple. Some players are so, like, all or nothing, black and white. Yeah, if you're unhappy about a couple things, you just fucking quit. No, like I've said nine times, I like to raid, so I'm going to keep on logging into raid. That's it. That, that's, that's, it's that simple. 
I'm in a guild. I like my guildies. I'm gonna, and I like, I like raiding, so I'm gonna keep doing that. Fucking al alar alarmist Andes. I'm gonna keep doing that, because I like to do that. It's that simple. It's that simple. Do you think you lost interest because you stream and kind of get streamer perks rather than struggling with the game like the rest of us? Do you, do you, do you watch my stream? Like, I know you do. I know you do. To what extent do you think I'm getting streamer perks? I am in a fucking boomer gamer dad guild where we wipe in Karazhan, okay? I have like 2,000 Princess Theradros kills because I farmed gold 18 hours a day <laughs> for the first five months of Classic WoW. I led a fucking top 10 raiding guild for the first 15 months of Classic Like, Like, what, 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 what perks? What perks are you talking about? I played this, I'm, I'm a, I played this game. I played this game, okay? No, like, I, I, I'm gonna be honest, okay? I'm gonna put you guys on blast. What I'm seeing in my chat is people that are looking and reaching and grasping and begging for any possible reason that could justify why I'm not having fun other than the fact that the game is less fun and Blizzard sucks fucking dick. You're grasping at any fucking reason possible other than the fact that it's just, it, it's, it's just, it's just, it's just a little bit more dog shit than it used to be. And here's, here's the thing, okay? This is the, this is the thing about having an opinion, okay? If you are loving TBC, if you are enjoying TBC, if you're having the time of your life, why do you care what I think? You're a gamer, I'm a gamer. There, there are, I, 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 I know you can understand my point about not enjoying the game because... There are tons of games you guys don't enjoy. The reason why you don't play Fortnite all day is because you don't enjoy it. The reason why I'm playing less TBC is because I don't enjoy it as much. Right? That's it. We don't have to agree all the time on everything always. If you're loving TBC, ignore what I'm saying and just play TBC. That's it. But if people are in my chat asking how I feel... I'll tell them. I'm going to keep it real, right? There's a reason why I stream TBC like probably 10 hours a week and do other shit outside of that. I've been, I've been doing that now for, I don't know, five weeks, six weeks. And I'm, I'm going to be honest, okay? I'm going to be even more honest. Every time I do stream TBC, the 10 hours a week I do stream TBC, it's hard and frustrating because my chat becomes so aggressive. They're, like the, the WoW community right now is just so... It's just, people are just so mad and vitriolic and zealous and toxic. When I'm not streaming WoW, I'm going to keep it real. I have way more fun. My chat is way happier, way more chill. So at this point, it's like, they're, uh, they're, they're de de defensive. Yes, yeah, I might just like, I I'm, I'm not going to stop raiding. I'm going to keep raiding and I'm going to keep uh, playing with my guild because I have fun. Uh, as far as as far as rating goes, but I might just stop ra stop streaming it because the streaming aspect of that, because of how chat gets, is so. It may it makes it less fun for me. I'm I'm gonna be honest because people are so like aggressive and zealous and it, it just like relax relax. It's like it's like people are mad at me for not enjoying the game as much. And it's like, dude, I'm just, a, I'm just a guy. I'm just, a, I'm, I'm, I'm just a dude that plays games. You know what I mean? I'm just enjoying the game less. That's it. And then every time I do stream it, when I do want to have fun playing it, I'm put on the spot to defend why I'm not having as much fun. It's like, hey, dickhead, maybe you're a big, maybe you're a big part of that. You know what I mean? It, it, it gets tiring. It, it gets tiring. Like when I, when I do want to play TBC. Which is my raid days. I just want to play and have fun. And not have to defend why I'm, why I'm doing it less. When I do want to do it, I want to do it. And not have to defend why other times I don't want to do it. You know what I mean?